what is going on YouTube so coming back today with another video concerning injury which kind of sucks but it's something I wanted to talk about anyway and today I wanted to talk about a pretty gruesome injury that happened last night let me pull up something right quick but that was the Teddy Bridgewater injury I'm pretty sure at least I'm gonna assume if you're watching this video you've already seen what happened um, you know, just an unfortunate injury for Teddy Bridgewater and the entire Vikings organization. Um, after, you know, a team that was just look, looked like they were headed on the way up this year. Um, really maybe even make a push for the Super Bowl. And now I believe they're down to Sean Hill at quarterback. But Teddy Bridgewater does have I do what I do believe is a torn ACL um, and a dislocated knee. Um, he's expected to make a full recovery. Apparently there's a slight possibility that he could be back by the end of the season, but I just don't think that's actually going to happen. You know, my personal thing is I, I like Teddy Bridgewater. I thought that he was going to be very successful in the NFL coming out of college. Um, I thought he was a little bit underrated coming out of college after he was picked. It was like 30th, 29th to 30th overall by the Vikings, but that's long that, that that's in the past now. Um, you know, do the Vikings still have a chance is a big question that pops up after this injury. And, you know, you still have possibly, I mean, argu very arguably the best running back in the NFL in that backfield. So I'd say yes. And I mean, they still reloaded at wide receiver. The wide receiving core actually doesn't look bad this year between Treadwell and Stephon Diggs. If Cordell Patterson can get it together this year. And then even some degree, Charles Johnson as well. Um, you know, I, I really liked what the Vikings had in place heading into this season. I had them at least as a wild card team this year. Um, I think this is a team that also has a pretty stout defense. And I don't think their season's done by any stretch of the mind. Um, you know, they might go after a free agent quarterback. I know that's been some big speculation uh, recently. Um, and I'll pay attention to that storyline as it furthers on. Um, who knows, maybe, maybe go after one of the most hated players in the NFL right now in Colin Kaepernick. I know Michael Vick's name's been thrown around a little bit as well, um, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't trust him for an or to last an entire season at this point. Um, Talent-wise, he'd give you just about as much as any quarterback on free agents, though. Um, then another thing I guess to pay attention to, um, I don't think it'll actually happen, but possibly could, is a uh, Mark Sanchez trade to the Vikings because I know that the Broncos, ever since they named Trevor Simeon's their starting quarterback, have been very heavily shopping Mark Sanchez. But anyway, that'll pretty much do it for this video. Like I said yesterday, I'm extremely stoked to be at 1,000 subscribers. Um, I, this next video is actually going to be concerning that. Um, I got my Bulls preview uploaded earlier today, and then I'll have this one and then the 1,000 subscriber video. But anyway, that's pretty much it. See ya.